Yo, 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 what is going on guys and it's your boy RRB Plays here today bringing you guys yet another FIFA 20 squad builder on the channel and in today's video as you guys can tell by the title of the video I'm going to be showing you guys one of the most insane probably one of the best 300k teams right now that is indeed built around this new released team of the season so far Danny Ings by the way guys this Danny Ings card looks absolutely ridiculous as you guys can see he's got four star uh, weak foot or four star skill moves his stats that's absolutely insane so if you guys are thinking about doing him um then i recommend you guys go ahead and uh, and do him and if you guys have already done him then yeah you guys smart decision because it actually does look like a very very usable player at this stage of fifa but the team that i built around him is absolutely ridiculous and it will destroy your opponents in foot champions but before i do go ahead and dive into the squad builder i got a quick little message for you guys i got two things to quickly say to you guys let me get straight into it number one the first thing is make sure you guys go ahead and click the link down below in the description after watching this video and check out my foot champions highlights right part one and part two um i'll just leave a link to part two um down below in the description so make sure you guys go ahead and check that out also guys another message for you guys if you want me to build your own personal squad builder yes that's right guys you heard correctly if you want me to build your own personal squad builder all you guys have to do is simply follow a few simple steps all you guys have to do is literally like this video subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications and once you've done that take a picture screenshot that head over to my instagram follow my instagram and then once you follow my instagram dm me send me that picture and prove to me that you've done those things and once you've proved to me that you've done those things i'll then build your squad it's literally that simple literally that easy but enough of me talking let's waste no more time and get straight into the squad builder so without further ado let's get it let's go okay so as you guys can see right now on your screens for this insane 300k team the formation that you guys want to use is indeed the 433 third variation but that's only to get everyone on full chemistry at the end of the video i will show you guys what formation to switch to with this incredible team but with that being said ladies and gentlemen let's just get straight into the team and we're going to start off with the left wing position and we do have an absolute beast we do have an incredible player man and in for Manchester United player man the star man himself Marcus Rashford and it is indeed his 85 rated left mid card is in form card this card is absolutely insane this card is ridiculous it's sweaty it's overpowered he's pacey his finishing is ridiculous his shot power is insane his attacking positioning is very good he's super super agile his ball control and dribbling is extremely overpowered in this game as well he also does have five star skill moves which I do like about him a lot high high work rates yes he's only got three star weak foot but honestly because he's out wide it's not really that important in my opinion having a freestyle a weak foot player out on the wing really isn't that bad at all but overall man Marcus Rashford in the game is definitely one of the best cheap sweaty left wingers that you guys can get in the game so I highly 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 recommend that you guys go ahead and pick him up because he is an absolute beast but with that being said let's go ahead and move on in towards the right winger spot and we do have a lovely little foot birthday card and yet another five star skiller player in the team he goes by the name of Hervine Lozano and in my opinion man this card is is absolutely ridiculous this card is insane i really really did enjoy using this card when i did um use him earlier on in the year as you guys can see man he does have five star skill moves and four star weak foot i mean you just cannot go wrong with that he's also very very pacey with 97 sprint speed and 90 acceleration his finishing is decent as well he's got 84 finishing 84 shot power and 89 attack and positioning and, and the thing that i love about lozano like the most is the fact that he's just so 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 agile guys as you can see man he's got 98 agility um 87 ball control and 90 dribbling so i really really do recommend you guys go ahead and pick up lozano he is just an absolute beast man he will literally just terrorize the opponent's defenses so literally guys just make sure you go ahead and pick him up but moving on though in towards the midfield we go in the central center mid spot we actually have a new released card and it is indeed a man of the match card and uh he goes by the name of Jaden Sancho, man i'm actually glad that his man of the match card is in this position man it made this like building this team a lot easier finding that english cam because there's not really like many any good English or Premier League cams and um, there's not many to choose from but I feel like this is the best player you could go for in this position um at Jalen Sancho man in that cam spot is going to be just ridiculous it's going to be lethal because he's got five star skill moves he's got four star weak for his pace his finishing is good he's super agile got high balance high ball control and high uh, high dribbling like you just cannot go wrong with using this man of the match Jalen Sancho card and that's why I do recommend that you guys go ahead and pick him up because he just genuinely is an absolute or like an absolute beastly player um 
yeah man his finishing is ridiculous his attacking positioning is ridiculous his agility you guys can see 96 balance 95 uh, ball control 92 dribbling 97 it's just crazy man so just make sure you guys go ahead and pick up this new release man of the match card Jaden Sancho absolutely insane but with that being said let's go ahead and move on in towards the left center mid spot we do have yet another Borussia Dortmund player and of course man it's going to be the man himself in form Delaney one of my favorite um, Bundesliga center mids to use in this game especially especially considering how cheap he is and how good he is it's just crazy that you can get him for that price um he literally costs around 20k and i just genuinely think he's just a beast bros he's a well-rounded midfielder very very good at defending but also good going forward i'm um, just reliable in any situation to be honest and that's what i like um that's why that's what i like about delaney the most man he just really is a reliable central midfielder as you can see man in terms of defending a very very overpowered he's got 90 slide tackle 85 standing tackle 81 defensive awareness and 87 interceptions he also does have 93 jumping eight uh, 78 strength and 86 aggression his dribbling isn't the, like isn't that bad at all um his passing is decent his finishing is decent as well but overall man as a center mid slash cdm um you just cannot go wrong with using delaney so make sure you guys go ahead and pick him up and i just want to say one more thing guys as well don't forget to buy uh, Jaden sancho uh, at least uh, as a cam a cam will center mid and it will get full chemistry right? i just want to make that very very clear because i know some people will comment why doesn't jado Jaden sancho have full chemistry literally because he's out of position but that being said um let's go ahead and uh, move on in towards the right cdm spot and we do have alan um and you guys know how i feel about alan man he's just a beast he really just is insane in the game man again well-rounded midfielder very very good at defending um high dribbling as well that's what i do like about him and also going forward in terms of shooting and things like that he is very very good as well he's got 80 uh, 89 interceptions 88 defensive awareness 88 standing tackle and 86 slide tackle and 94 stamina as well i highly recommend you guys go ahead and pick him up because he just genuinely is a beast and uh yeah you just cannot go wrong with using this alan car man and i'm pretty sure you guys watching this video know that already that alan is a beast man his dribbling his composure ball control agility also is very good and that's why i just like him i just think that in game he is a beast man and he also does have four star skill moves as well just to put the icing on the cake but with that being said that is the midfield completed let's go ahead and move on in towards the defense so in the right back spot we do have kevin malquit and you guys know how it is with malquit man it's just a decent fullback obviously he is just the best cheap Serie A right back that you guys can get I mean the only other good Serie A right but you guys can get is literally that shapeshifters Hatabar but he's like 100k and there's just no point spending 100k on the right back honestly I even myself like I think the difference between the two is very very like minimal so honestly just don't worry about um Malquit too much because he, he he gets the basics done now, at the end of the day that's all you need from your fullbacks is just to get the basics done just for them to win the ball back from the uh, the opposition's wingers and then just release it literally man as long as they can do that man then yeah you're in for a treat so mild quick man very decent fullback decent amount of pace and good uh good defensively what i would say to improve my quick's performance in game is just to like buy like a shadow or or catalyst chemistry style just so that pace does increase a little bit more but other than that man incredible incredible player so just make sure you guys go ahead and uh pick him up but moving on in towards the left back spot we do have yet another Borussia Dortmund player man he goes by the name of Nico Schultz a very very just just a very typical man pacey um fullback very very fast but also defensively um good as well got 90 sprint speed and 89 acceleration there as you guys can see he's also got a 78 sl uh, slide tackle and 77 standing tackle with 75 defensive awareness um not too bad defensively man just very sweaty pacey and he just genuinely be he just genuinely uh, will be a pain to play against so yeah make sure you guys go in and get schultz again you just cannot go wrong um with getting someone like him he's got the pace he's got the defensive attributes you just cannot go wrong but moving on though in towards the center of market partnership we go we're gonna start off with the right center back spot and i'm not gonna lie man this partnership here this duo is actually very very incredible it really is and they're gonna do you well man they will do you well together they are just a brick wall it's crazy man they're gonna be so hard to get past but in the right center back spot we do have um delict man and delict is just incredible and it is gonna be the ones to watch right make sure you get his 88 rated ones to watch because it, for some reason the one source version seems to be cheaper than his inform 88 version so just make sure you guys go ahead and get his ones to watch 88 version all right i just want to make that very 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 clear but this delete card is absolutely insane and in game he feels 10 times better than what the stats even do suggest i mean i know his stats already are very good but in game he's just next level i don't know there's something about the lit you just get that overpowered feeling when using him in game and he's just crazy man he's absolutely ridiculous so i just do recommend you guys go in and get him 
as you guys can see though he's got a decent amount of pace 77 sprint speed and 65 acceleration again i would recommend buying a delict with like a catalyst or shadow chemistry style just to further further increase that pace um in terms of defending man very very good 87 interceptions 92 defensive awareness 87 standing tackle and 85 um sliding tackle as well and he does have 91 strength which is absolutely ridiculous and then in the left center uh, in the left center back spot we do have um a halloween scent just um this card again just ridiculous and i don't know why it's not coming up maybe do i spell it like this with the j-u-s-t-e does that work yes it does um so yeah the halloween um the scream is sent just man this card is ridiculous very very pacey man as you guys can see there man 85 acceleration and 84 sprint speed um 83 slide tackle 85 standing tackle 80 defensive awareness and 83 interceptions i would say again in game he feel, he, like he outperforms his stats he feels a lot better than what the stats actually do suggest so again nothing really to worry about in terms of defending for sent just because he is a beast in game so yeah i recommend you guys go in and pick him up you just simply cannot go wrong and to be honest these two complement each other very very well he's the more like stocky slower but very very good in terms of defending and uh he's just the more pace here more agile center back so they do really complement each other well and that's why i rec recommend you guys use these two as a partnership the dutch partnership will get you very very far in fifa 20 but in goal to complete this insane team we do have in form jasper sillison the 85 rated goalkeeper um a beast of a player in game man honestly not too bad at all and i really really do recommend you guys go ahead and pick him up obviously there's only so much keeper can do but i do recommend you guys go ahead again because he is the best dutch goalkeeper and to be honest in game he is a very very good one so with that being said this is the team completed but we're not done here yet i need to quickly show you guys what formation to switch to in game so i'm gonna quickly do that now the formation that you guys want to switch to in game is indeed the 4-2-3-1 formation and you guys should set up like should set up like this so you're gonna have of course Dan Danny Ings up top, you're gonna have Marcus Rashford out on the left, Lozano out on the right, Jaden Sancho, uh, Jada Sancho in the central cam spot, and then Alan Delaney as the two CDMs, and then the defensive lineup will stay the same. So that's literally how you guys want to set up the team. Let me know your thoughts down below of this insane 300k team down below in the comment section. Give it a rating out of 10, guys. I really, really want to know what you guys think of this team because me personally, I think this team is absolutely insane. I think you guys will destroy your opponents um, um, with this team. So yeah, make sure you guys let me know your thoughts down below. If you guys did enjoy the video don't forget to smash a like button don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications and also don't forget to follow my instagram get me to 300 followers on instagram guys it would be much appreciated but nevertheless i hope you guys did enjoy the video as i was saying man don't forget to like comment and subscribe turn on post notifications all that good stuff your support is so much appreciated and also guys don't forget to click the link down below in the comment section and watch my foot champions highlights but without further ado man it's been your boy rb players i hope you did enjoy the video and i will catch you in the next one Peace.